Hello guys, Cooper Ross on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into this video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes, and if you haven't already, make sure to drop us up. So, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about George Hall and the links surrounding him. Now, George Hall has done brilliant this season under John Eustace. Um, 18 years old, got a lot of potential, got a good career ahead of him, and uh, apparently in January... Leads are going to be coming in for him. Now, of course, remember, I don't know what his name was. It was Miller something. I don't know who's, I can't remember his first name, but they got um, a youngster from us. I think it was last summer, didn't they? And uh, I don't know what's happened to him, to be fair. Probably gone out on loan somewhere. But yeah, um, Leeds United want another of our, of our um, youngsters. Um, Birmingham City manager John Eustace commented, um, commented, commented, on it, sorry, saying um, he is not surprised that George Hall has attracted interest from other clubs. The 18 year old has been linked with a move to Leeds United with the Daily Mail describing his departure in January, in January as inevitable. Hall has enjoyed an impressive breakthrough season at St Andrews. The young England, the England under 19 midfielder, scored his first goal for the club in a 1 1 draw against Watford in August. I remember that goal, coolly taken. First goal for the club. He made his debut in the 2-1 home defeat to QPR back in 2022. He made two appearances last season. This season, he has made 17 league appearances already. So he's more than quadrupled the starts and the, uh, you know, the appearances he had last season. He has 18 months left on his contract. And Eustace believes his development is better served by playing regularly in the Championship rather than the under-21s at Leeds. Well... If if Leeds are going to sign him, f just for him to be in the in the under twenty ones, I don't think that's worth it. Really, we'd better get a good transfer fee if um, Leeds United do sign George Hall in January. It'll be a massive loss. It'll be a massive disappointment as well because, you know, when he's come, when he's made an appearance on the bench, he's changed the game. He's changed games. I mean, you saw the game against Sunderland. Do you like the more than most of them players? In like 20 minutes than they did in the whole game so yeah obviously we want to keep hold of George Hall um, I think John Eustace has managed him well you know he's not just throwing him in the deep end to play every single game but I do think it's now time for him to start more games because um, I know Bakuna I don't know Bakuna this season I know he got that brilliant goal against Hull City and he was an unbelievable strike but I do think there's there's a play when he started Joe Bellingham against Sunderland Friday night. That should have been George Hall. George Hall should be starting more games for Blues, and uh, I think we need to time down to a, a longer contract. Really, eighteen months left. That means we'll probably get about one or two million for him. And yeah, um, so yeah, let me know in the uh, comments down below. George Hall to Leeds United in January. This could be a deal. That does happen, but I don't. I obviously don't want it to happen because, yeah, it'll be a massive blow, and we'll hardly get any money for him. So, yeah, hopefully, this leads interest just like dies down, and they don't actually put in any any official offers for him because, like I said, we need to keep him really. Anyway, it's been Keeper on TV here. Make sure to like, share and also subscribe to the channel. Let's see if we can get 100 likes. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of um, this development, like I said. Anyway, thanks for watching. Keep right on.